strike to Greg 0 and 1. That was strange when Pinella motioned out there. Charlton started coming in. He took about five steps. That's twice. He came into the dugout earlier in the game thinking he was coming in, but Danny Jackson stayed up. Greg 0 for 5 career against Rob Dibble, hitting an even 100 for the year, 6 for 60. And he's behind in the count 0 and 2. As a pinch hitter, Greg has all six of his hits this year, six for 22. Second, Injustice, the winning run at first in Infante. Two men out, bottom of the ninth. And the two-strike pitch to Tommy Gregg, he stays alive. Each of the last two nights, the guy who has looked the best in batting practice for Atlanta has been Tommy Gregg. Last night hit about six straight over the right field wall but then got into the game as a pinch hitter and struck out. Rob Dibble doesn't pitch batting practice for anybody. It's a little different. But you never know. Nothing into the count. Dibble deals. This is high. Two strikes to Tommy Gregg. Fly ball well hit right center field. Hatcher going back, still going back. Over his head off the wall. In the score is justice. The game is tied. In the score is Infante. The Braves win. Tommy Gregg, a two-run double. Over the head of center fielder Billy Hatcher. And tonight it's the Braves who celebrate. Cincinnati has blown a lead in the ninth inning. Braves win it 4-3. 